Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Sim City 4. Yes, I know it's been a very long time since I've done anything Sim City related, but I decided that today, just for you, I would be generous and start this up again. Oh man, I have missed playing this game. You know, Cities XL is fun, but Sim City, in my opinion, still remains the you know the more classic and probably the more superior game overall. Don't get me wrong, I'll probably go back to Cities XL, but yeah, SimCity is SimCity. And that's what I have to say about that. Anyway, we are once again here in Trinity, as you can see. Um I am going to tell you exactly what I'm going to plan on doing. We are going to work on a big project. As you can see, you know, here's our main downtown areas from Dwyerengrad over to Prospectsburg and up to Frederick the Great. This whole big area is sort of our prosperous, wealthy downtown district. But I believe it's impeded somewhat by the presence of stinky old Petrograd down here. I mean, let's take a look at some... the air pollution... yeah. I mean... It's seeping over a little bit into here, but it's really bad right here. And I want the middle of the map to be free of, uh, as free from this crap as I can, you know? Water pollute. Water pollution will be uh, right there. Take a look. It's pretty heavy, just like we said. We don't want black rivers and such, you know? I mean, yeah, there's plenty of other industrial areas strewn about, but, um, you know, this one here is the one that's the most damaging, I think, being so close to the middle of everything. So my plan is we are going to turn Petrograd into another extension of the downtown, you know, another swanky urban place to live. I want to demolish all that and replace it with apartments and offices and stuff. Of course, we have the problem of industrial demand. And to fix that, I'm going to be building a feeder city over beyond this boundary pretty soon, you know. The city of Scudville is a little bit too far away to really use for Trinity. It was going to be a feeder city for something else. But yes, um, to facilitate the transportation of people from this area to that area, I will be constructing a new expressway. It will pretty much follow this road. We'll start here, go through here, intersect with this other um, expressway, which I have neglected the name, apparently. And I think I'll even have it cross over and continue on through here. Because why not? All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's begin the construction. So, open up our highways tab, and it's going to be an elevated highway. And I don't want it to be too far above stuff. It's going to be, you know, this is going to be part of it, I think. All right. Okay, the first bit of our highway is created. And I want to have plenty of exit ramps for construction for good transportation. So, and I want to make every ramp on this highway a uh, nice avenue ramp, you know? So, we're just gonna do that, and come on, oh. Yeah, it's probably gonna be a jerk to us, but it's all right, we'll find a way, you know? Nope, 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 nope. 
There we go. Yes, it kind of looks weird and out of place, but keep in mind it is for expansion purposes. And there are a lot of things that look like this out in the world. Well, the Pink Expressway, it can be it can be a problem. It's going to need to be relocated for sure. But there's two things we can do. We can have it start here and then pick up over there. Or we can just rebuild it around this general area. So... The easier thing to do would just be to have it intersect here. Now one thing to keep in mind is that this highway, the Pink Expressway, is not very much used. I mean, in theory, I could just tear it out entirely and nobody would really mind very much. But I don't know. All right. Massive construction. All right, let's see. Yeah, the slopes might make this a little difficult. In fact, might make it out might make it outright impossible. Could have that, but there's no way to go southbound. Eh, who needs to go southbound on this road here? Well, I could derp it up like this. There we go. All right. Uh, sort you up like that. And there you go. Good as new. If I destroy you, will that destroy you? Nope, good. Okay. All right. The Pink Expressway... We'll use some of the original road for the Pink Expressway, but it will no longer be the Pink Expressway. Oh man, we'll leave this as like a little tribute because it's always interesting to see abandoned bits of highway and wonder what did that used to be back in the day. Oh man, but yes. You might wonder, what are we going to name this highway? But do not worry, I have a name in mind. We are going to call this the Applejack Expressway after everybody's favorite farm pony indeed so she since she's a nice hard-working pony we're gonna have a expressway for all the hard workers of our cities to be traveling around all right let's uh uh, yes, you are annoying, aren't you? All right, up you go. Let's fix up this pink expressway a little bit. Yay, we're still going to have a tunnel of some variety. Uh... Okay. Having trouble. Having trouble. Okay, here we go. You, I want you to be a good boy and do that. There we go. Alright, so we're going to have you, Mr. Highway, flip around here. And, well, there's no need for this tunnel anymore. So, come on. All right, I probably have to destroy that, um, destroy that bridge, too. Or it might not be essential to do that. 
find out here in a second. Uh, yeah. Yay! And we did it without having to destroy that intersection or anything. Just sneaks around there, and yeah, there we go. We'll have a piece of the former Pink Expressway over there. And we'll just put up a sign as a reminder to everyone what this is. The Pink Expressway. Indeed. Alright, now here we go. Yeah, you're no longer going to go that way because this is not the course <coughs> Ooh, of the Pink Expressway. I'm going to blow you up. i leave that there as a reminder, just for fun. Alright. Well, we now have to think ahead to where our exits are going to be. I wonder if I should have one up here. Oh man, it's time to blow up a huge amount of land. Boom, crash. So what we are going to do is, first of all, we're going to upgrade this to elevated. All the way out to here. Yeah, sure, okay. And, we're going to see if we can sneak in some form of... Some form of ramps. Why will you not build ramps there? Why... Huh. Yeah, sloped land is annoying. You don't need me to tell you that, and we're destroying an inordinate amount of stuff in the city to build this, so... Oh, right. Oh, come on, you didn't give me any that time. Oh, what the hell. Uh... Alright, well let's get experimenting. Alright. Can you give me a T? Alright, and you can give me a T that goes down to a thing. This might not be the most elegant solution, but it should work. All right. Why don't you connect? Okay. Well, we can always just sledgehammer that all home. Yes, massive demolition. So we're going to demolish that. We're going to demolish you. Let's see. Can I sneak you under here? Alright. There we go. You are connected. Let's connect to you if we can. Why can't we connect to you? There we go. You missed the road. Come around here. But we're already moving on. Oh man, it's kind of ironic that we're demolishing Sweet Apple Acres in order to make the Applejack Expressway. But oh well. Sometimes quite ironic sacrifices do need to be made. 
I don't think this wire needs to exist anymore. The power is being transitioned through far more areas. All right. And I do intend to urbanize this area at some point, so let's uh, see if we can sneak in this over here. No? Okay. Oh. Oh. Let's see. Now we're just going to expand things right now while we, uh, while there's nothing in the area. Should be a very helpful thing to do. All right, there we go. Can I make this like that? No? Oh well. Fix you all up. They can still loop around and go through if they want. All right. And now... We are gonna have some form of a funky here. All right, and a full set of entrance ramps. There we go. Replacing most of the road that we had previously demolished. There we go. It's beautiful. And now we recklessly destroy more graves, dig up more dead people, and move from other places. I do have to think of a new place for those graveyards, I think. Uh, should bury them somewhere that no one's gonna care about. Put them like on a mountain or something. Hmm. It's kind of stupid how much room these things take up, but well, I guess you gotta put the dead people somewhere. So there. There's your cemetery. I hope you're happy with it. Well, this is such a derp exit right here, but oh well. I've seen far derpier in my time. Oh man, it's a wonderful thing. Okay, so we already know that's going to be an exit. And this will also be an exit. So may this be a piece of cake, just to... Blow you up, blow you up. What? You gave me nothing. There we go, you give me something now. I guess it wasn't just enough. This wasn't enough room on the one side. Alright, I'm not sure if I want to make you into a full avenue all the way, but we'll at least avenue you up right for that area. Can exit out here. Have a good time and enjoy some cookies. That is sure one get away with it. Okay, good. Because from here on, we're going to be traveling in urban areas, and we're going to literally replace the Jason Fesson Boulevard with the Applejack Expressway. So this whole area, we will demolish, we'll relocate that train station. Sorry, rich person and all you guys, you all have to go. I kind of regret blowing up some of those high wealth things. But it's for the greater good. And don't worry. This will give us possibilities to build greater things than we have ever imagined. Alright, so... I'm gonna grab you, wiggle you over here. We'll get you over there. And you are gonna end right. Whoa, okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. That makes you look derpy. Alright, we'll do this again. 
It's a good thing I have a lot of money. All right, now what we're going to do is we're going to take one off this railway. And we are going to make this avenue under. Yeah, there we go. And now we're going to put everything back into place. Well, crap. Mr. Railway, you've kind of bungled us all up. We're going to have to go kind of nuts to make you work. It's kind of stupid, but <laughs> otherwise we'd have to go all the way to, like, there or something. And that's even more stupid, so... There. Because that is the most elegant solution that we can think of right now. We have a station there. We have a station up there. I say we put two stations. One here. One up here. Let's build roads. And there. People's rail service will not be interrupted. Alright. Now what we are going to do is, 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 continue the road over here. And sadly we're going to probably have to demolish this high wealth building if we want to have some sort of exit ramp over here. Although, I don't know. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's just build the highway first. Demolish only what needs to be demolished, and then we'll work out everything else from there. All right. And here's where things get interesting because I want to make some sort of intersection with that. So, what we are first going to do is drag this all through. It's a good thing this is happening on pause because imagine how much disruption that will be to everyone's commute if this happened in real time. Alright, let's go over here to our delicious little tea. And we're gonna have to demolish a lot. Watch all of that. We're gonna have to demolish all of this. And all of that. We're gonna demolish that. And that and that. All right. Yes, a lot must be demolished in order to. Uh... All right, we don't have it yet, do we? Okay, more has to go. All right. Well, let's just demolish all of this. Okay. Demolish this, that, that, and all that. We're entirely changing this area. All right, hold on. Yeah, I want to. Uh... Oh, I know we're close. I know we're close to getting this. All right, let's see. What do you want from me? What's wrong? What do we still have going on here? Okay. Demolish you. Demolish you. Demolish both of you. And you and you. Screw this all up. Screw that all up. I mean, we're destroying the industry over here anyway at some point, so. It's okay. No, what do you want from me? You fool. 
Maybe I have to start from that. What do you want from me? Oh, good. I'm going to kill somebody. Okay. All right. No, I said I clicked on the bulldozer tool. All right, we're gonna demolish bulldozer, fucking bulldozer. Okay, thank you. Oh, there we go. Uh, I don't, I don't understand. We've given you everything you wanted. Oh, do we have to dezone all this? All right. Here we go, a huge area with nothing. Nothing. We have removed everything of value from this area. All right, new theory. Let's just take out the highway entirely in this area. Look at this desolation. It's pretty, uh, pretty funny actually. Let's take this out. And... There. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is what we've been trying to build this entire time. And now we just need to fix the connections. Alright, but you have to be a ground highway, don't you? good so far. Well, this messes up our rails to no end. Ooh. Yes. Well, our rail lines are screwed beyond help, possibly, or maybe not. We're just going to have to get a little creative with the way we uh, reorient them. I think we can go under here, can't we? As you can tell, this is going to be a big, really big restructuring of everything. We're going on a massive destruction fest. All right. That doesn't look half as derpy as I thought it would. All right, now that we've Redirected the rail over there. We just need to bend it over here, too. All right. There we go. Oh, well, isn't that good? But 
Still, we might have a problem with this one. Unless the rails can go under all of this, that would be too much to ask. Yeah, it would be. But now we have to drag this through unclaimed terrain, including in, right in front of City Hall. So basically, right in front of City Hall is going to be this monstrous elevated rail or highway. Okay. Demolishing everything in this area because we're going to want some form of exit. Oh, there's a lot of low well stuff in this area, so not that much of a loss, really, when you think about it. Just blow you all up. Blow you up. And time to build our final exit before crossing the river. Okay. Oh, pfft. silly. Silliness. Silliness, silliness. You're not long enough, are you? Alright, well I have no idea how this is all going to connect up. So, for now... Are you really not going to give me that? Well, I guess not. Okay. Okay, it is going to give me that. What do you know? We're just going to do this for now. Hopefully everyone will be happy with that, and we'll make sure everyone got it. Wait, why are there no ramps on this side of the road? Now there are. Just had to blow up a few more buildings. Alright, now I'm trying to try to make a bridge. And now it's time to bring this wave of destruction that we call an expressway to the other shore. So, start with a little destruction here. Oh, what a quaint little neighborhood. It's almost too bad that it's going to get all smashed to shit by... My wonderful highway. Now, I'm pretty sure we're going to have to clear more room, but let's just try dragging it out. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright. What we're going to need to do is, in a wide area, we're going to have to destroy everything that is near the water. Destroy and even dezone it. Just an area of desolation, including some crazy surviving farmland that's just been here for a while. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty crazy what stays behind. All right. But anyway, we'll bring our dezoning wand around to here. You're all gone. You will end you over here. And we're just going to build this. What can we build? We have any number of styles. Well, let's go with the street arc. Because the street arc is cool. Oh man, alright. And now it is time for the people of Bonerville to say hello to their new highway neighbor. Oh man, here we go. Let's see. Looking ahead here, we're probably going to have to jiggle it a little bit. But, first of all, we need an exit ramp. 
So. Say hello to your new avenue. Whoa. Alright, we're gonna need to make more room. Okay, that mansion looks kinda craggly, so we're gonna blow up the craggly mansion. And there we have it. No. Blow you up. You look nice, but we're just gonna say you were a tax evader or something like that. Okay, why nothing on this side? Why nothing on this side? Alright. What the hell, man? What the hell? Alright, let's be on the safe side. Demolish all this, too. And dezone it. You know, we'll be changing the character of a lot more than one neighborhood. Whoa. Whoa, oh. Uh, what a poop. What a poop. Ugh. Yay. And there we have it. Everything is fine and dandy. Everyone's happy. Babies are singing songs and Christmas carols and such. Alright, so that's good. We're just going to do a quick little patch job on all this. Should be good and happy for everyone. Let's see if I can sneak this road under. Can I? No. Can I sneak it under over here? No. Alright, road, you're just gonna have to be a dead end. We're gonna road up some areas here as a um, bypass of what is now a closed road, not to be confused with a clothed road. Because after all, how can you put clothes on a road? I don't, I don't know how it's possible. I don't think anyone's ever actually done that before. I mean, you know, you can put clothes on a road, like, throw them out of a car and, hey, there's clothes on the road now, but does that really satisfy the conditions of the, uh, of the story? I think not. Okay. What we're going to do is demolish this row of houses. It's crazy how much the screen can shake sometimes when you're, uh, doing demolitions. Now is it possible to just... Yeah, okay. Good. So we're just gonna sneak this on by. But I also desire to have another exit over here. Blowing up some more craggly mansions. Oh. Silly me. Forgot to blow you up. There we go. Let's link you up all over the place here. Another exit. It's almost sad in a way how much destruction is being wrought by this new uh, expressway being put in, but I'm sure people will be finding finding new opportunities in these new lands, and it'll be quite wonderful. All right, time to continue. What we are going to do now is Continue this on through here. And probably to the edge of the map. We're in the clear now. Sorry for all you peaceful people who just wanted to live by the lake. You're going to get knocked over in favor of a big-ass expressway. And our little parkway here is going to have to be realigned. But yep, 
we can connect it right up with the simnation. Alright. We need one more exit before we leave. Where will we put it? Over here. We're gonna some we're gonna somehow squeeze it in right here. With more demolitions needed, of course, but could you really expect anything less? Oh, come on. Just gonna crunch this entire area. Crunch it all. There we go. Tell me I can't do that. Don't you tell me I can't do that. Now I hope that works. Alright, here we go. There we go. It's elegant and efficient. I dig it. I dig it a lot. I'm gonna link this around here. All right. Well, we've now extended it as far as I can go in that direction. All right. And now what we're going to do is. Scroll over, and now we're gonna have to fit one or two more exits in this area. All right. Well, we can fit one in there and one up there. Alright, well I really hate to demolish any high wealth buildings, but you're going to have to go. As are you. But, it's all in the name of progress. Alright. What a huge <laughs> and very destructive project this has been. All right. Gonna take that out. And there we go. everything up bright and new. Whoa. There we go. Make sure there's a nice little um, traffic light here. Now we're going to connect you to here. There you go. And there is that little pride. All right, now only one more exit to build, and it will be over here. 
and then we can call this a completed project. So, one last demolition spree. Oh, will I miss the demolition spree? Yes, I sure will. I will miss blowing stuff up, but there's no reason that it needs to stop anytime soon. I'm pretty sure there will be plenty more destruction needed. Alright. Did you give me nothing? Oh, well, I didn't demolish nearly enough, did I? Oh yeah, there's parks over here and over there too. Okay, blow up you for the hell of it. Just to make things complete. Oh, right. Now let's, uh... There we go. Yay! Just link you guys up. And let's see if we can smash you down there in a funky way. Or we're just gonna do that. We're just going to do zone you. And there we have it. All the exits have been built. All right, now what we're going to do is go over the entire thing and make sure everything is connected up as it should be. Yes, I mean in terms of the roads and rails and such that goes under. All right, well, we already fixed that. You're kind of on your own now, aren't you? Uh, two nice mansions that will not be able to be connected. Well, we're gonna have to blow one of you up. And make this street go around. And let us, while we're doing this, take some time to zone in commercial buildings and residential. No industrial, mind you. We just want to make this nice and complete for everyone who We'll come back in. We want to make sure this is all nice and hooked up before we turn the time back on. Oh man, after all this time playing SimCity, it still sounds funny to say we're going to turn the time on and stuff like that. But, all part of the game, you know? Alright, well here's another area where things get funky. Ideally, I'd like to stretch this road under, but I don't think I can. I can! <laughs> How about that? All right, anyway, that being taken care of. Let's throw you up there. Lots of commercial. We'll take this opportunity to heighten the zone, or heighten the uh, levels of stuffs built here. I'll be really damn surprised if I could sneak this under. Yeah, I didn't think so. All right. Well, none of these match up, so what we're going to do is you are just going to uh, go like that. Alright. And that will be a link under there. And damn, we really... This area has been completely devastated by these projects, as we know. Oh, right. Yeah, like everything has been cut off. Rail has been cut off. Everything else. 
Are people setting off firecrackers outside my apartment? I can't really tell. Oh well. But yeah. Let's take a look at our subway lines because I know we. You know, I don't know if any of the lines themselves were, uh. Oh geez, neither of you are connected to stations. Okay. Well, here's what we're gonna do for you guys. We're gonna connect to you. Connect to you. And somewhere in this vicinity, we need a station or two. All right. Put you there. We're gonna throw one of you here too because. I greatly doubt we'll be able to have any kind of great, uh, you know, great connection under there. All right. Well, this whole boulevard, this whole expressway here is kind of unnecessary. Uh, this whole area is kind of unnecessary right now, the way it's situated. So what we are going to do is just leave it absolutely blank. We are going to demolish this, like I said, we're just going to leave it absolutely blank until the new era begins. Demolish all of you. This shouldn't be a prop. Yeah, it's not. Okay, good. I was worried for a second there. Oh yeah, we're going to... Hook you up. Yes, there's just gaps where nothing is anymore in the city. But they will all be filled in in due time. So, nobody worry. Panicking is not allowed. Oh, man. Very exciting. Oh, man. All right, now, let's see. Yeah, this, if you want to get through, you have to go around up there. You have to go down there to go through here, or you have to sneak through over there. Yeah, the connection, the infrastructure in this area has been completely screwed. But what can you do, right? They'll just have to get used to their new reality. In fact, I might be able to put a road under here. Didn't think of that. No, I can Never mind. Alright, guys. Well... You're not connected to anything, so first of all, we're going to dezone you. Second of all, you're going to have a street up to here, which we will put a traffic light. And third of all, we're going to have to blow you up to extend that street, so that's all connected. And you are now nothing but a little thumb down here. Oh well. Okay, now... Um, yeah, people are gonna have to... We might have just forced a lot of people to use the highway just because we destroyed every other means of getting around in this area. I mean, if we can ever find a way to sneak the rail through anymore, that's gonna be a trick. So basically, yeah, the rail just sort of goes up here, goes around, comes through. But, I guess subways will have much more of a function here. Well, we already determined this road can't go through. But, can this street go through? Sure it can. Okay. We're gonna just demolish you. Alright, let's demolish you and start fresh with some... with some medium wealth residential in this vicinity. All right, yes. And I think you're all connected up. Okay. We'll just zone some small little pleasant houses along here. Such as might have been here before. And we will plant 
trees in this area. Plenty of trees. I hope everything works out. All right, well, everything else is connected. I think it's good. The only thing left for us to do is turn the time back on. Okay, and here we go. Turning on the time. We'll see how low our population drops. We only lost 2,000 people. But, let's let things whir on forward. Oh wow, we just got a huge jump. I think a building was finished somewhere. But we spend a good chunk of our treasury. I mean, we certainly do have plenty of money stashed away. We're losing a little bit, though. What do you look at that? Let's look at our budget. Why are we spending so much money on utilities? Power, water department. It's crazy how much things cost when you have a city this size. All right. But yeah, how much would we gain if we just ticked up, ticked up a little bit of taxes, just a little bit, just a little bit. All right, we're making a profit now just by easing up taxes a little bit on people, or not easing them up, but increasing them a bit. I don't know if an increase of half a percent is going to do much. All right. So, yeah, I'll, a lot of the new stuff that we put down didn't zone yet, but I think in bigger cities it takes a while for the um, new stuff to grow just because you know the, there's so much to process with all the different demands and such that each parcel of land isn't going to be as light and springy as it would have been in a small city. Well now it's time to see well let's let this thing so run some more. Yeah we'll check that out in a minute I'm sure but let's check out levels of traffic. Well starting here there's nobody except freight trucks and no one here but freight trucks. Alright, we're having some cars on here. Get down here, are some cars. How many people are using this exit? A few. As you can see, people are already using our highways. Alright. Now, once we cross over here, we increase to quite a lot of people. Alright, looks good. And do I lock it off here? Some do. But the majority continue on, I see. What's your problem? Well, it sucks to be you then, doesn't it? All right. All right, well, apparently everyone gets off here. And some people are going this way. All right small number of cars here. Let's see. A few people are crossing the bridge here, but not that many. How many people are on the new section to this highway? Not many here. What a fair number here. I mean, these numbers aren't huge or anything, but... So hardly anyone's using this bridge. Are they still using this bridge? No, hardly anyone's using this bridge either. Where are they crossing? Some on that train, some on that train. Not many people are crossing the river at all. And apparently, the few people who are are getting off here, because this part of the highway is not doesn't seem to be used by anyone. Hardly anyone's even driving down here at all. But like I said, it's for future expansion as much as it is for the present moment. Now. Let's look at traffic in general. 
volume's good. See, we have a, a healthy amount on here. A lot of people seem to be traveling along here. It's good I made that a avenue, you know. All right. Let's look at the uh, passenger train. If I can find it. Passenger train. All right, yeah. Well, this is a dead end now, apparently. So... Yeah, there's sort of a gap here, you know, uh, people aren't going to be able to get over here unless they go all the way around here. But, the most busy places go out to Avocado, go around through here, this area. But the subway is really where the future of our city lies, you know. And I intend to expand subway service more at some point. But so far, it seems to be being used quite a bit. So let's see. I, I detect congestion down here. Okay. I'm going to increase you into a road. It still hasn't gone away completely, but... Yeah, it seems like, uh... Well, it seems like our demand is rising. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that brings us to the end of what I hope was a very interesting road construction edition of Trinity. On the next episode of Trinity, we are going to focus on this whole area. We're pretty much going to be ripping everything out from here, over to here, down to about here, to the edge of Riverside. So it's going to be quite an eventful episode, because this whole area is going to be demolished, basically, and we're going to have a new Petrograd in its place. It's going to be, uh, it's going to be fun, I promise. But that's if I decide to do Trinity next. I might decide to build that feeder city first. It's hard to say. But at any rate, I'm done for now, so thank you for watching and goodbye.